hello people this is kp and i welcome you to this exclusive video on chaos engineering so in this video we are going to see what is chaos engineering and uh, some overview brief overview about chaos engineering and finally we will see how to get certified okay so if you ask google what is chaos engineering you are going to get this answer chaos engineering is the discipline of experimenting on a software system in production in order to build confidence in the system's capability to withstand turbulent and unexpected conditions so this is something called uh, um, very long or you can think like complex example not example definition so let me simplify it so if you are a site reliability engineer or if you are a network admin or if you are working some infrastructure in IT environment then your work is something developing or maybe finally getting a product software product so chaos engineering is all about how much your software is resilient like how much resilient your software is how much reliable your software is okay so uh, just think chaos means some kind of disorder or confusion isn't it so this chaos engineering initiative was started by netflix in 2011 this was only for testing the resilience of its it infrastructure resilience means uh, after some drawback how fast it recovers and how uh, well it recovers okay so that is all about resilience so netflix invented one tool that is called chaos monkey it was written in golang if you know there is a language called go developed by google so it was written in golang so normally chaos engineering is mainly a strategy you can think for discovering the vulnerabilities in distributed system okay so you can think like uh, chaos engineering is all about testing a system's integrity by proactively simulating and identifying some failures proactively means before happening something we are doing or we are checking and reactively means after happens something after something disorder happens we will do some step we will take some step something like disaster recovery okay that is reactive but chaos engineering is all about doing things proactively all right so uh, what next so twilio netflix linkedin maybe facebook microsoft amazon these are some of the big giant companies technical companies who are using chaos engineering so uh, if you want some data or facts or statistics about that i have uh, found some link let me show you so this is uh, one article may be provided by gremlin okay so what is gremlin gremlin is a company it has its own software it also does the same thing for chaos engineering <clears throat> okay so gremlin religious state of chaos engineering 2020 report you can go and read so i told you netflix invented one software that is called chaos monkey so instead of chaos monkey you can also use some of the alternative softwares what are those those are given by gremlin okay so uh, this link i will provide all these links in description below then you can read from there for apache hadoop kafka spark containers um, infrastructure java os okay you can just read what are the alternatives what you can use instead of chaos monkey so this was a great document or blog provided by gremlin okay and uh, <clears throat> here also something yes this is all about gremlin company so they are saying proactively improve the reliability so it is all about improve the reliability or resilience of a setup or a software okay so you can check the cpu the shutdown block hole memory dns and all those things if you are a network admin or maybe a site reliability engineer or software engineer it is the most demanding you can uh, go for okay so let's discuss about how to get certified if you know about uh, some technology it is always better let's get certified maybe oracle certified maybe aws certified maybe uh, what else something like red hat certified cisco certified okay 
similarly in chaos engineering there is this gremlin company is started one initiative of this uh, just go to google and search gremlin certified chaos engineering practitioner so this is the first step so you are going to get this link just click on that and here you can read announcing the gremlin chaos engineering practitioner certificate program it is a free of cost okay so you can just read go down and read all those things okay and how to get started uh, this is your certificate interface let me show you okay i'll show you at the end i have already certified today only so just click here get certified and uh, here it will ask for your email address go and sign up okay so uh, just go and sign up after it give me a minute i'm just signing up for that i'm just uh, changing the screen okay you just stay here by the meantime i'm just signing in okay i'm selecting my account giving my password <clears throat> all right now let me again share that screen yes now i hope you can see now i am logged in okay let me show you how the interface behind looks like so this exam is a non proctored exam there will be nobody to proctor you guys you can just read and some blogs some articles maybe some youtube videos and they are also providing some resources to read just go through it gain the knowledge and after that you can just go for the exam okay so the exam contains around 20 questions you have to attempt 20 questions in 3 to 4 attempts reattempt if in the first attempt you are failed then you can go for second attempt so the minimum passing mark is 80%. See here, Gremlin Certified Chaos Engineering Practitioner exam, two modules and it is of 30 minutes exam. Okay, there are no uh, um, resources provided here. They are just giving some overview. Here you can just view something. This is a around two minute video. And finally, GCP exam, some rules and regulations they are giving. Finally, you have to appear the exam. Let me show you just start here uh, when you enroll you can see here the start course as i have already finished so here i am seeing review course okay so let's start here you can see uh, exam guidelines in the first module as soon as you go to next module there you will face this gremlin certified engineering practitioner exam okay let me do what happens let's see okay i think yes so they are giving some uh, see here i have already passed this exam with 80 percent score so i i passed in tw two attempts and more attempts are remaining so these are some questions and these questions you can see and finally you can click on finish after giving the exam so you can see this screen and you can also go to view grades and dashboard etc and finally after certifying uh, you will get one mail from this gremlin let me show you i had received this mail so you can see my name here is your certificate for gremlin certified chaos engineering practitioner go down you can share it on your linkedin profile and also you can view your certificate so this is my certificate and you can also download share or send email or embed in some web page i'm just clicking on pdf so it will be in pdf format you can just download it okay so this is my certificate yes so that's all guys for this video i explained you some concepts some overview of chaos engineering and uh, what is the requirement and why it is uh, much in demand nowadays 
so just don't uh, leave this opportunity you have got one global certification opportunity for free no cost at all just spare some time on reading all the things all the concepts and uh, if you want some help in the exam then you can just comment down below in the description i will be helping you for passing the exam okay no problem for that and uh, that's all guys for this video and thank you so much hope you will just pass the exam and it will be helping you in your career thank you so much guys bye bye